Next up is a poet who is known for sparring with beatnik ghosts. Hi, folks. My name is Daniel Yaryan. This is my friend Philip Gutierrez. Kiss it. Kiss that mic. All right. How's this? All right. This is not a magic show. Everything is on, verge of extinction in the scope. Crazies put us here in this place, leaving us alone with our thoughts. And trick photography can't help us now. Weeping trees, dog children, the pure love of dim-witted canines, downtrodden compassion, without resource, Wallets flap wings into clouds, disappear. This is not a magic show. No applause, street theater collides with a disappointment of conclusion. Special effects keep our minds off the lament. But like all good medicines, they wear off over time. But as we build up a tolerance and find the rose bushes are shorter than we are, and our lenses are cracked as we see into and beyond, the delicate packages cradled in our arms could bottom out as the pulsations of our tired feet traversing jagged, earth-jostled sidewalks tap the system within, attacking the threads, holding it all together amidst the chaos. The symphony of life is erratic and unrehearsed. Gut-wrenching sorrow playing in the same section with ecstatic joy. The lighting on the stage is a dancing strobe full of promise and flows unyielding. Drenching the players with humor. Undecided on whether to turn dark or bust out the brights. A few blocks away on, I think it's Addison Street, they have the Poetry Walk with all the placards with all the poets. It's pretty cool if you guys haven't seen it. You guys have seen that? Poetry Walk? All right, cool. Well, uh, my favorite poet on that walk is William Everson, also known as Brother Antoninus. Brother Antoninus. Beat to the square and square to the beat. Beat to the square and square to the beat. As a Whitmanesque eye the, from the wild child of immaculate wilderness, swinging his scythe for a fragment of heaven, making God sigh in church rebellion. Antoninus. Beat friar years before deathbed clenches struggled with holy contemplation in fleeting mortality. Reluctantly relinquishing soul in near refusal, but still abiding by the brotherhood which brought his body to the sound burial stomping ground of monks, storing words of lament into hazy dying daylight repent. This led them to say the poet is dead. The poet is dead. In remembrance of the father of renaissance, once silence sheltered from an unimagined world outside holy glass panels shedding light into corridors of holy snores, drowning out electrifying earthly energies flowing upon the floorboards, he walked, capturing warmth upon the skin, natural man feeling gravitational pull of temptress's fiery pleas. For the spiritual center to lodge in mind, fly off tongue and dive, rest in heart. Breaking silence. Spill soul overflow into resounding standing ovations throughout the nation's spoken word stations. 
His verve, heard by Bohemia, heathens, derelicts of cool, and even the squares. Stuck in middle of division and crumbling West Coast literary shrine, old Frisco vision. And William Everson's cloaked icon, Antonina, soared above it all, snapping his habit. Almost done. Learning how to see in the dark. Artificial reality confuses reality, promotes the blind eye to the matter of fact, forces us to learn how to see in the dark, watching for fires, unvigilant 24-7 lookouts for intruders of the whole truth, mechanics of mining for mayhem, hijackers of sacred non-puritanical imagination, free of charge imagination, Anxiety-free, non-taxed images roaming the playhouse in our heads, uncensored, devoid fear of keeping our fingers on the handle to the drawbridge, holding our positions in the fort of our beliefs. Barricaded from battering rams we're up against, bashing every sliver, splinter, grain. That's it. One more little ditty and then I'm off here. Bella Iris Berkeley Driver before June 5th. Beautiful strumming strings sharing whereabouts of angelic beings and where they book their flights. I'm at your ticket window. Travel without wings, you tell me. No pilot, passenger, plane, plan, compass can compare. To the free flowing floating Zap Chen frequencies taking us on this non-stop tour of the earth below as we move forward toward our destination. Thank you.